Hello, it's Jay Foss back with War. Sorry for not uh, posting last war. Um, we faced Kobe Air. Uh, I did go six for six, which was nice. Uh, to be honest, I was just really hungover and didn't feel like posting. Um, we are at 29 this war. We're facing Last Legion, so hopefully I can get some of the boards that I got uh, last war because... They were nice, but yeah, let's see what happens here. Uh, I would say that is not a good starting board. Uh... It makes sense to focus around these blues. I'm just debating on how to do that. Could take the suggestion move. I mean, it's blue could come up, but I also need to be looking at clears. It does set up a potentially a decently large clear move if blue doesn't arrive, which it did not. Uh, so yeah, I guess we're looking at clears of at least six tiles. Hopefully we have at least one move like that. Uh, yeah, I mean, we, we have to clear here. Still nothing at all, really. Uh... My word. Well, Hawthor is going to fire anyway. It can set up a blue. We need something to jumble up this board. We do have the one blue. I'll need at least four, really, before the flanks and wings fire to get Ani going. Not looking promising, but let's go there. Okay, we got finally got a nice little cascade for a mini clear. Now we have to make a comeback against a defense that's going to be really hungered down after the uh, tank firing. And then, uh, Hawthor. We do have a big clear, though. Hopefully we can get blue or red coming up. Not really. I mean, I still kind of think it's a clear move. Is it going to kill Ani? Yeah, but Ani's kind of going to die anyway. Debating here, popping the diamond or playing something else. We do have a green into a blue. This is only, yeah, I'm basically going to have to start over with Ani dead, which is going to be a tough comeback, so we're going to need a clear. Did get some red. Helps slightly, but we will lose Ani here. I just don't have enough to cut through. Uh, we have the blue diamond. Probably leads in Armas firing. I'm debating actually taking a red so I can get Fenexa. I do have one red tile that I can get. Um, 
it's one turn left. If I could set off RMS or not set off Forceus or RMS and take this blue, that would be an option. How much is this poison? 90. Just a lot of good moves or decent moves. Question is, will I have enough time? I think I will. Oh, they did not charge. That's terrible. I thought I would with the mana gen and. Okay. Well, I need the heal now and I can't have their wing fire. Their wings fire, so. I need the heal though. Don't kill anyone, please. That passive's gonna wreck me. Oh my goodness. Okay. Clear it out and just try to get there. They just keep healing. Gonna be too a little too late. Yeah, that's over. <sighs> well, shit. Um hate having a poor start like this after six of six previous four. Uh, I mean, is there really any chance that I even get more damage? Try that, we'll see if that was a mistake. Extra combo. No dodging. Yeah, that's a flea. Great start. All right, hit two. Hopefully this goes better than hit one. They do have mixed tanks, as you can see. Mostly uh, green, though, with a few red and even one yellow, or one pur a few purple. Well, blue diamond is not bad. There's a bunch of blue. We can get to eight blue. Maybe without setting off anyone. At the end of the world here, I'm going to make a dead move to wait for the auto taunt to go away, but I'm going to cast Ariel. So my seven tile red heroes charge. I want to get this minus defense off first. Now, I would normally be casting this to the right or left because I view the left side as. But I'm going to do this to the right so that I can clear, hopefully, to the right at least in a lane or two. Damn, I got the withstand there. That was. That sucks. Um. Still not a disaster. Who do I want to hit? I'm not going to have a ghosting lane. Well, I could if I... Do it this way. Did not want that many combos. And just set up the red over there.
Cleanse that off next turn. Two done. Hit three. I'm gonna try this. This is a former teammate of mine. I don't know if they remember, but from way back. Double checking, all right. Okay, we can set up one red into Magni. Oh, we have a yellow move that goes into a purple that sets up both of our reds. I obviously like that. So we have red. Let's just look at how to do it the safest way, or if there's even something better. Let's do here first. Hmm. This strands the least. I'm getting an extra one. I will have to be thinking blue as well and what does not mess up my blue. Uh, let's do that. Should be able to get back around to blue in time. Gotta think about pacing here. Uh, so this is risky to an extent because of the superior dodge. Yeah, let's do that. It is still sometimes odd adjusting to these. You know, you have teams that work for a while and then as the power creeps and limit breakers and all that come in, they don't work as good anymore. And I think definitely a week ago saw it with a team like this. Oh, I messed up my blue. I need that blue. can get it a variety of other ways. Don't really want simultaneous fire. Hopefully that's not simultaneous fire. Of course, it's tying with arrows. All right, uh... Let's just save that red for next turn when he's going to fire anyway. See if anything presented itself that was better. This is going to hurt if the dispel triggers from the passive. I did not. Set up our red and go from there. Nice bonus blue there. And the dodge is on. have taunt so should be all right <laughs> mm. 
Mm, sit up red there. Blue could come up. It's taking a lot longer than I thought it would on this one. <laughs> All right, let's get some dodges again. Three done. All right, bringing out yet another red team here. Do have to watch two druids for it, so Jima. Um, let's look at how we can improve this. It's not bad, but it's kind of disconnected. We do need nine here. Red, basically. Could set up a red dragon. Semi-hopeful, but also plays into hippo. Hmm. I don't hate this green vertical out of the be out of the gate due to being able to cluster some reds together in a location where I don't currently have a match. I'll start with the dragon. I hate firing hippo early. We need to get our supports going quickly. So we can... Let's see, what do we want to do here? We can maybe force fire Ojima before... Hippo fires, that's a possibility. Uh... need to get I can set up a red under the tank hmm because I do want to get the supports going to an extent I also don't know if that tile is going to force fire this is what I'm going to do Okay, now that's more in line with what I was after. Uh, so we have red or green. I guess I need to look at timing here. I think we're good to take red here and green next turn, potentially. Can clear off Hippo. Now I need some more. Basically starting over. Well, maybe even slightly worse than starting over. Need my mana to get going. Uh, I was hoping... Timing was not ideal there. So the man will get those two going next turn, but I won't have Ray for Dispel. Uh, we'll try this and they can have a green backup if Red doesn't arrive. Heal up, get the Dispel. I know I had heroes charged. I don't, I don't want to risk the dodge here. Get the dispel. The dodge, the dispel, okay. That's lovely. Is there even any point in firing? I 
Other than see how many dodges I can get in a row, let's do that. That could theoretically help. Two dodges in a row. I'm not a conspiracy theorist, but this is a... Uh, there's no way the dodge is correct on defense. Maybe one day when I have 37 extra hours, I'll do a actual study. Um. So yeah, I mean, there's no point in firing the rabbit. Granny Ninja's going to heal and I got to go. Otherwise, even if I turn this around, I won't have a chance for a comeback. Get the mana going again. I need to dispel Hippo. Not force fire Ojima. Well, now I can't dispel, right? Because of the dodge. From the previous cycle thing. This is just going to go forever until a timeout, probably. <laughs> I kind of have to heal again. Just getting whittled away, basically. This is not great. Uh, set up red. Guaranteed dodge here. Oh! First time ever. All three hit? Someone was listening, and they're like, it's... I forgot Hippo still fires on the mindless. All right, let's get moving so we don't time out here. Granny is covered. How about you just... Somebody die. How about that? Somebody die quickly because we're running out of time. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, quickly. <laughs> Dispel. I know the timing's off on a bunch of things here. Let's do this side with this so we can focus on having a side too clear. Two. Two minutes, I gotta go. Fine, we'll do that. They're under the Cupid thing, so can clear there. Come on, animations, hurry up. Little fire on them. I thought his thing was whatever. Just go away. Having to rush a little bit here. Obviously, wouldn't normally play this fast. Still alive after some evades. Come on, stupid animations. There we go. Nope, maybe. Finally, that was a tight one. 
Hit five it is. Bringing out Dispel and Block Bluffs here. And six tile. Hopefully he can get ahead of the tank. It isn't bad. Uh, do have a shot at a red diamond. Do not, I think, currently have the six blue that I need. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it, it's a chance. If it doesn't hit, then you can reevaluate at the time. Multiple chances at getting to like six purple. Now I just gotta do it without setting off the tank. So you're mana blocked now for two turns. Uh, I'm good with this move to get Onyx to a higher charge. We got a revive of a Panther out. Kind of have ghosting options both ways. And again, I don't know if Onyx Charge 2 will kill anything here. I can kill Ojima for sure. All right, time to get the red going. Particularly why he still has the buff thing up. I want the status block thing, even though it's off of arrow timing, to prevent Archie, because I'm about to play into Archie. Now start over and get more purple. Uh, there's a chance coming up there. We'll need to heal again fairly soon. I can set that up, though, with the purple move. And do the red. Um, let's get you off the, off the radar, at least close to it. Again, timing's off, but it is boosted. We'll clear. It's not a bad clear time. Nice combo at the bottom there. All right, five done. All right, six and final hit. Uh, there's an open clean on the board and kind of close to reset, so... I'm not sitting on 5 of 5, so taking it so it doesn't slow down reset. Alright, we have purple into Erlang, or we could ghost it. Let's ghost it. Chance of purple coming up at the bottom. Alright, they got some status immunity up, but be fine. What is that, six? I need one more purple. Don't oh, combo. Jeez. I'll get Erlang out of here at least. I'll revive again. I 
Maybe you're laying out of here. No, nope. revive. I'm starting to get a little nervous. Them potentially firing again. Hmm. I have the blue diamond. Don't really want to pop that just yet. How many turns on this? Oh, a bunch of turns. Or Lang die finally. Nope. Certainly with the plus defense, should be able to take a hit from that guy. <laughs> Barely. Uh, they don't have attack down anymore. Let's clear there and get this potentially going. And get our final purples. See if we get a dodge. Double dodge. Oh, I got one. This isn't a real team per se, but I've been using this new red as a one in the war and kind of liking it. So figured a clean and okay place to experiment. Hit six done. Uh, we are playing a 29. Mm, where am I at? 264. Okay, not bad. We have 58. We have 71. So in really good shape. Uh, sorry again for not posting Soul Exchange and uh, Last War, but should be back on track now. Thanks for watching.